December 1957, after a patchy first half of the new season, United signed goalkeeper Harry Gregg from Doncaster Rovers for a record fee of £23,500. So out of a world record fee, I got what was called an accrued share of benefit. I got £33. But honestly, I'd have paid £33 in those days to join Manchester United. It was everybody's dream. United's second European campaign was well underway. They'd beaten Shamrock Rovers and Czechoslovakia inside Dukla Prague. Bad weather in Prague ended in a problematic return journey, and United decided to charter their own plane for the next foreign encounter, a trip beyond the Iron Curtain to face Yugoslavia inside Red Star Belgrade. After demonstrating the grit to match their flair, the babes were through to the semi-finals for the second successive year. They were going well in the FA Cup. Their form in the league had picked up. All that was left to do was to celebrate victory and make the journey back to Manchester. The vital game against table-topping Wolves waiting for them. Sadly, many of them would never see home again. Weather was bad um, and there was uh, snow on the, on the runway and they didn't have the facilities that they have these days, you know. At 2.30 p.m., with the wings still warm and having received clearance for takeoff, the plane began rolling on its first attempt. You could, you could hear the engines revving and, 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 and getting really loud, and then he put his brakes on. A second attempted takeoff was aborted at 2.35. We set off again and we went much, much further and the, the wheels were making a big bow wave, like a bow, a boat in the bow. But the second time, the bow wave was much, much bigger. I felt it, you know, what the hell? Tommy Taylor happened to be passing by and, 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 and he said to me, uh, I, I hope this time they, they will have, uh, uh, you know, they will look into it properly. The plane would then make its third and fatal takeoff attempt. The pilots and ground crew once again surveyed the wings and saw no reason for them to be de-iced. At three minutes past three, the plane started rolling. One minute later, it would end in disaster. We came down, we bounced once, twice, three or four times. We bounced. I thought I'm going to get killed. And that was it. Everything went black. Mm -hmm. 